details about missing two-month-old Kion Jones of D.C. The baby's mother faced a judge today. She's charged with felony murder and tampering with evidence. He was um, on the bed with me on my chest. When I was asleep, rolled over, noticed that he was unresponsive, breathing, and I panicked. LaDonia Boggs dropped a bombshell when she spoke to our Colby Satterfield last Sunday, telling WUSA 9 what she said happened to her infant son. According to court documents, that was four days after she first told the baby's father that Child and Family Services picked up the two-month-old and that he would be gone, quote, for a long time. Police say when officers stopped by her home to check on the child, she said he didn't live there. Court documents indicate the mother's story changed numerous times until police say she admitted to throwing away the infant after he was found unresponsive in her bed. Got a blanket and his car seat and wrapped up and took it outside and disposed of it in the trash. Police say Boggs was caught on surveillance camera, hauling a car seat, then a cardboard box and plastic bag to the dumpster. According to court documents, Boggs admits she was high on PCP at the time. Boggs was released today in order to stay away from children, including her one-year-old grandchild, unless another adult is present. She'll be back in court mid-November.